overhauling the way America's less fortunate get food. Instead of getting food stamps, President Donald Trump's new budget calls for a food delivery box that the government says will save money and provide healthier options. But not everyone agrees. 10 News reporter Lesla Gooden found out what this could mean for our communities. Maureen Best is already helping needy families in Roanoke receive healthy foods. The director for the local environmental agricultural project in Roanoke, known as LEAP, she says the Trump administration's plan will cut funding for farmers markets that offers incentive programs for SNAP users. $84,000 in SNAP were spent at farmers markets. Uh, about 110 farmers markets across the state accept, accepted SNAP. And all of that money, close to uh, $400,000, uh, was money that stayed in the economy. The proposal is called America's Harvest Box. SNAP recipients' benefits would be used to buy a box of food that the government describes as nutritious and 100% grown and produced in the U.S. The other half would still be distributed on SNAP cards like it's done now. It would affect anyone who receives $90 a month in food assistance, roughly 38 million people. The harvest box is said to cost nearly half as it would than purchasing at retail. And it's supposed to include canned fruits and canned meats like these. There are many who are concerned about how fruit and vegetables will remain fresh in these boxes and how people with dietary needs will receive what they need. To be a healthy person and have a healthy lifestyle than to start with the food that you're eating. So uh, again, I hope that they allow points of access for that and uh, I hope that the program still allows people to come in and make some of those choices. Lozogoda in 10 News, working for you.